Last 34 years, every summer, thousands of kids have descended on Belle Isle for an annual event that's all about education, sports, health, wellness, and staying in school. It's Metro Detroit Youth Day, and this year it's happening on Wednesday, July 12th. Uh, that's two weeks from today. Joining me this morning is Ed Deeb, who's the founder of the Youth Day. Good to see you again, friend. Hey, thanks, Chuck. Yeah. Good to be here. And we're also joined by Dr. Emil Lazanoff, who's from Wayne State University. Good to see you. Nice to yeah. see you, too. And Ryan, who is a special guest. He's our producer's son. He's been on the show before and around the show. He knows what's going on. He's going to help with some of the experiments. Let's not blow anything up, okay? I'll try not to. Okay, he's going to try not to. So, <laughs> Ed, this is the 35th year. Yes. That's your youth day. 35th. Awesome. Yeah, this is the largest uh, youth event in the state of Michigan. Yeah. We'll have over 35,000 kids, and uh, they'll have all kinds of activity for them to, to deal with. And, uh, and the whole goal is to inspire these kids to do the most good and to eventually get to college, graduate, and become good citizens. Is it still growing after all this time? It still is. Every time I hear you say a number, it seems well, bigger than uh, last year. Well, I think we're going to have a couple thousand more this year, the, way, right? the way the registrations are going. So I think we're going to do better. Good for you. What a great heart to get this thing going. And then you wake up one day, and here you get to look at all that proof of the pudding, right? <laughs> Dr. Emil, now let's talk about what you'll be presenting, because you've got very unique skills when it comes to picking calendar dates, doing the square root of numbers, but also science is part of this, not just math. Yes, correct. Because everything in this world is made from chemicals. Chemicals are elsewhere. We not uh, products are made from chemicals. We eat chemicals, as you see oh, yeah. in fruits and they're in the human's bodies also. But here, uh, I'll show demonstrations at the Metro Detroit Youth Day. I show science, several demonstrations. Students will do an experiment, mm -hmm. and they will learn why uh, natural rain is not neutral. It is slightly acidic. What can, what can Ryan do? Because I want to make sure he gets in on this action. He, he, with, for what we have to pay him, I want to make sure. Oh, OK, uh, he can ask me the day, uh, his favorite month of oh, the here. year. We and got a the calendar. Day. Don't let so Dr. Emil see this. the day. Yeah, pick, eventually, pick any day, any date you want. Right? Yes. You're going to give him month, the day of the week. Month and date. I'll okay. say the day. Okay. Okay. Give me any month and date. Your favorite. Um, July third. July third. Well, this is Monday. Mm -hmm. Check, oh, correct. <laughs> see, I asked you my birthday, August second, and right away. August second. This is Wednesday. <laughs> it's amazing. And then you can also do the square roots of numbers. Uh, I can, I can, uh, all these numbers eventually here. All right. I can uh, multiply some of them faster. We haven't worked this out, just so everybody knows. Square root of 49. 49, and the answer is 240, uh, 2481. So I, I should have said square it, not the square root. <laughs> square that number. What's the answer again? This is the square. Yeah, yeah the square. Uh, okay, 49, yeah. one more time. Uh, two, four, zero, one. All right, somebody at home is going two, like four, this on zero, this. One. Two, four, <laughs> zero, one. Yeah. All right, so tell us about these chemicals again, because they all look fun and colorful, but what With do they do? these chemicals, we show the rainbow colors here, and I right. can make if the students, kids ask me what kind of color, uh, what's your favorite color, or what's they ask me to do red. any color. Red? Yeah. Okay, okay, let I do a red color then for you. Yeah. What's going to happen? We have so-called uh, acid-base indicators, they sh which are dyes. Mm -hmm. They will change color depending of the acidity, basicity, or neutrality. And this indicator have a range where they change color. Yeah, what did that do? Do you accept this red? It signifies wow. that liquid, this liquid is basic. Is basic. Liquids. Okay. On a pH scale from 0 to 14, over 7 to 14 are basic liquids. All, most of the cleaners in the houses are basic liquids. Oven cleaner mm -hmm. contains sodium hydroxide. Ammonia cleaner contains ammonia. And what are these? What are these uh, this, for? Uh, Here, this stand are, back, because I want your mom and dad to see, make sure you're home. We have home. fun with science, huh? and actually these are demonstrations to visualize uh, oxidation reduction reactions, or so-called redox reactions. See, what's the color now? Yeah. Well, yeah. This is the color? Look at how <laughs> the color So changes. what did that signify? What just it happened? It signifies <clears throat> that uh, the, the, previous, the previous color, when I shake, it takes oxygen from air, and the color becomes, oh. let's say, red. 
Uh, yeah. Here it becomes uh, blue. When you're adding oxygen. Uh, yeah. Yes. Can Ryan yes. shake yes. this a one? Different amount. Yeah. What, will, what will happen to this uh, one? Let's see. Let's see. Go ahead. Shake happen. it up. It starts off yellow. Whoa! That's simply by adding oxygen. And the color comes back because uh, the substance reduces here and the color becomes yeah, like glucose, glucose reduces. All right. Actually, more and more oxygen. So, Ed, tell us again. how we can uh, not uh, only try to stump the doctor, but tell us about the event again. How can people get information? Oh, they can call our office uh, in, uh, we're in Warren, 586-393-8801, or they can get us through the uh, internet. Uh, it's uh, MetroDetroitYouthDay.org. All right. And uh, we're going to have uh, a special treat this year. We have College Row with 14 colleges and universities. And that's going to be a very attractive thing to sure. help the kids out. And then we're going to give out several uh, awards to distinguished people that have helped us over the years. That's great. Well, it's so, good to see you all. Enjoy the you. July 12th Thank date. Thank Thanks so much, much, guys. Thanks, Ryan. Okay, let's show nice job. Magic. We can show up. I've got to get through it to Tati. Go ahead. Good to see you. Yeah. Nice to see Tati. you. Tati. <laughs> okay.